AMD Ryzen processors are the favorite of us all now, and the company released third-generation AMD processors last year. One of the most attractive processors from the third-generation Ryzen processors is the AMD Ryzen 7 3800X, which is a Bindocta core processor, succeeding AMD Ryzen 7 2700X from the previous generation. As for the motherboards are concerned, one of the biggest advantages of the AMD platform is that you can use older generation motherboards with the latest processors as well, which means that you can use the Ryzen 7 3800X with 400 series motherboards as well. In this video, we will be having a look at the best motherboards for Ryzen 7 3800X, which are more than capable of handling this beast of a processor. To get more information on any of these products, check out the links in the description box below for more information, and don't forget to subscribe to Gaming Gadgets Geek's YouTube channel. Starting our list with Asus ROG Strix X570E. The first motherboard that we have on our list is Asus ROG Strix X570E. We are all aware of the products of Asus, especially those who are well versed in the knowledge of computer hardware. ROG is the subsidiary of ASUS, who is dedicated to designing some of the best hardware all around the world, and that is why their products are hugely appreciated by the community. ASUS ROG Strix X570E is a mainstream motherboard, providing high-end features, but it does not cost as much as the flagship motherboard series like ASUS ROG Crosshair, and that is why it keeps a balanced profile between price and performance. One of the best things about this motherboard is that it features an amazing design, and that is expected from ASUS ROG. There is a large ROG logo at the IOA panel cover along with Strix written, and both of these are RGB lit. The heat sink of the chipset also has some RGB lighting, but that is not as apparent as the ROG logo. The motherboard provides an all-black theme, which is great for both black-colored cases and white-colored cases. The motherboard is based on the latest chipset of the AMD, which is X570, and this can be easily guessed from the name of the motherboard of the motherboard. The biggest advantage of this chipset over the X470 is that it comes with PCIe 4.0, while X470 came with PCIe 3.0. Moreover, the memory speeds are hugely increased in these motherboards, and now some of these X570 motherboards can go as much as 5000 MHz on the RAM. This particular motherboard, Asus ROG Strix X570e, features four DIMM slots and hereby supports a maximum memory of 128 GB by using 32 GB modules and can support a maximum memory speed of 4400 MHz, which is still a long way from most of the X470 motherboards. The I.O. of the motherboard consists of 5 by 3.5 mm audio jacks, 1x optical SPDIF out, 2x antenna outputs, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, 7x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A ports, a BIOS flashback button, 2x Ethernet ports, an HDMI 2.0 port, and a DisplayPort 1.2 port. The motherboard provides a 1G Ethernet and a 2.5G Ethernet, which is pretty impressive and it should easily saturate the networking needs of most enthusiasts. As for the slots, there are three PCIe X16 slots, where two of them are reinforced with metal to provide ample support for high-end graphics cards, and apart from this, there are two PCIe X1 slots. As for the storage, there are eight SATA 3 ports, which is more than what you would find on most motherboards, and two M2 slots, both of which are covered by heat sink that covers the main chipset as well. The VRM of the motherboard looks pretty interesting. It has huge complex-shaped heat sinks, the likes of which are not present on average priced motherboards. The 12 plus 4 power phase of the motherboard takes overclocking to the next generation, and you won't feel any problem overclocking processors like AMD Ryzen 7 3800X Asus ROG Strix X570E is a motherboard that is priced higher than most mainstream motherboards, but provides high-end features, as well as durable components that can take a beating. The motherboard is more than enough to handle overclocking on processors like AMD Ryzen 7 3800X, and if you want to upgrade in the future, it can easily handle fourth-generation processors as well or the likes of Ryzen 3950X. At number 2 it's ASRock B450M Steel Legend. The next motherboard that we have on the list is pretty interesting. ASRock used to be a subsidiary of ASUS, but later got separated and started designing some of the best-valued products in the market. ASRock B450M Steel Legend is such a motherboard, and unlike the ASUS ROG Strix X570E, it focuses on value and budget. The design of the motherboard makes this motherboard a lot different than most motherboards in the market. 
The use of digital camouflage along with white-colored heat sinks and covers shines the motherboard and lighting, and it would look stunning in a white case, like NZXTH510i. This is a micro ATX motherboard, which means that it has wider compatibility with cases, and if you own a small case, this motherboard could be best for you. The Iowa panel cover is pretty large, white in color, and has sharp RGB lighting at the right edge. The chipset heatsink, on the other hand, is quite small and has RGB lighting underneath it. The motherboard is based on the B450 chipset, and the best thing about the B450 chipset is that it is a lot cheaper than X470 or X570 based motherboards. Surely, the performance is lower than these two mentioned chipsets, especially in the memory department, but this motherboard can still run memory at 3466 MHz, and if you are lucky you could go for 3600 MHz as well. There are four DIMM slots, which can easily fulfill the requirements of budget gamers. Despite having a micro ATX form factor, the motherboard provides two PCIe X16 slots and one PCIe X1 slot. One of the PCIe X16 slots is heavily reinforced with metal, so you won't have trouble with tri-fan graphics cards weighing around 2 kgs. For storage, the motherboard provides four SATA 3 ports, which is a bit less than ATX motherboards, but the motherboard provides two M2 slots, which compensates for the loss in the number of SATA 3 ports. The I.O. of the motherboard has 5x3.5mm audio jacks, an optical SPDIF out, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A port, 4x USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, 2x USB 2.0 Type-A ports, an Ethernet port, an HDMI port, a DP port, and a PS2 port. Some people might find the lack of a BIOS flash button or CMOS button a bit problematic, but we are sure it won't be a problem for budget gamers. The weakest link in the chain of this motherboard is its VRM, as it provides six-phase power. That is why you won't be able to juice the Ryzen 7 3800X at the maximum, but still, a bit of overclocking won't hurt the motherboard. ASRock B450M Steel Legend is a motherboard that attracts a lot of budget users, and that is where lies the key point of the motherboard. You won't find a similarly priced motherboard with this good performance and looks, especially if you want to buy a motherboard for a processor like AMD Ryzen 7 3800X. At number 3 it's MSI MPG X570 Gaming Plus. MSI is a serious competitor to Asus when it comes to motherboards and graphics cards, and that is these companies have a similar share in the market. MSI MPG X570 Gaming Plus takes a different route than Asus ROG Strix X570E and focuses purely on performance, completely ignoring the bells and whistles like large-scale RGB lighting. The motherboard, as described earlier, doesn't focus much on performance, and that is why it doesn't have RGB lighting on the IOA panel cover or the chipset heat sink. Instead, the chipset heat sink has a large fan that helps in keeping the chipset cool. The motherboard does provide a bit of red color here and there, which shows it as a gaming keyboard. The use of server-grade PCB makes this motherboard more durable than other similarly priced X570-based motherboards. The motherboard is based on the X570 chipset, just like a SUS ROG Strix X570E, but this motherboard costs a lot less, making it attractive for people who want to save money. The performance of the motherboard is still pretty impressive for the price, and you get the exclusive features of the X570 chipset as well. The I.O. of the motherboard provides 5x3.5mm audio jacks, 1x optical SPDIF out, a LAN port, 3x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A ports, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, 2x USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, 2x USB 2.0 Type-A ports, an HDMI port, a BIOS flashback button, and a PS2 port. There are four DIMM slots on the motherboard, and the maximum memory speed of the motherboard is the same as ROG Strix X570E, which is 4400 MHz. As for the slots, there are two PCIe X16 slots and three X1 slots. The motherboard provides two M2 slots, and it comes with a heat sink that can be used on the upper M2 slot, while the bottom one is bare. Also, there are six SATA 3 slots on the motherboard. This motherboard provides 8 plus 2 phase VRM that is enough for processors like AMD Ryzen 7 3800X, but it might not be able to handle all hands overclocking on the processors like 3950X. The VRM heat sinks are quite thick and well made and do their job well.
MSIMPG X570 Gaming Plus is a very impressive motherboard for the price and on this list, if we were to pick the best value motherboard, it would be this motherboard. The performance of this motherboard is just astonishing for the price, and you can't expect this level of performance for this price, as this motherboard is even cheaper than some high-end B550 based motherboards. At number 4 it's Asus ROG Crosshair 8 Formula. Asus ROG Crosshair series is the flagship series motherboards that are designed to provide top-notch performance and come at a hefty price. Asus ROG Crosshair 8 Formula motherboard is based on the X570 chipset and is one of the most expensive X570 motherboards. Everything about this motherboard is exceptional, whether you talk about performance or aesthetics. First of all, the motherboard looks pretty badass due to use of large-sized heat sinks. Speaking of heat sinks, the motherboard is capable of cooling the VRM heat sinks by liquid cooling, and X seems to have collaborated in this project with Asus. The heat sink of the main chipset is actively cooled by a fan, while the motherboard has the ROG logo here as well. Both the IOA panel cover and the chipset heat sink have a mirror finish with RGB lighting underneath. The IOA panel provides 5x gold-plated 3.5mm audio jacks, an optical SPDIF out, 7x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A ports, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, 4x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A ports, 2x Ethernet ports, a BIOS flashback button, a CMOS button, and 2x antenna outputs. There are three PCIe X16 slots, one PCIe X1 slot, two M2 slots, and eight SATA 3 ports. The most notable aspects of this motherboard are its VRM, which provides 14 plus 2 phase power, and having the capability to be cooled through liquid cooling. Moreover, the motherboard provides a 5G Ethernet, which is jaw-dropping. For audio, the motherboard uses the industry-leading Supermifts S1220 codec. Asus ROG Crosshair 8 formula is the best in every field whether that be the performance, looks, features, or whatever. The motherboard provides supremely capable VRM cooling, and it comes with high-end LAN and audio chipset, providing the user with the best experience that he can expect from X570 chipset, although all of this comes at a hefty price, as it is one of the most expensive X570 based motherboards. At number 5 it's MSI B450 Tomahawk Max. MSI Tomahawk Max is a motherboard that we had on our wish list since the very beginning. The motherboard is known to provide a great value, as it provides great performance and costs a lot lower than high-end motherboards. The design of the motherboard is fairly common. It uses a black and gray color scheme and looks pretty average. There are four DIMM slots on the motherboard and five PCIe slots, where two of them are PCIe X16 and the rest are PCIe X1. The DIMM slots are not reinforced with metal, but the first X16 slot is, and it is pretty common in mid-range motherboards. The IOA of the motherboard is fairly minimal, with 6x audio jacks, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A port, 1x USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, 2x USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, a DVI port, an HDMI port, 2x USB 2.0 Type-A ports, an Ethernet port, a BIOS button, and a PS2 port. The VRM of the motherboard provides 4 plus 2 phase power delivery, but the implementation is quite impressive, and that is why this motherboard can easily host Trizen 73800X, or even the 3900X, as long as the casing is well ventilated. A great thing about this motherboard is that it can support high-speed memory sticks very well, and you can use up to 4133MHz sticks, which is quite unexpected from a B450-based motherboard. MSI B450 Tomahawk Max is a great motherboard that tries to provide high performance while being a lot cheaper than high-end motherboards. Its capability of high-performance memory sticks is pretty impressive as it tops even some X470 motherboards as well. And with that we come to the end of our review. In this video, we have listed some of the best motherboard for Ryzen 73800X and have provided various categories, whether that be a budget motherboard, small-sized motherboard, enthusiast-grade motherboard, or a super cheap one. All of these motherboards will support the fourth-generation Ryzen processors, and most probably you won't have to upgrade the motherboard as long as you buy an octa-core processor from the fourth-generation Ryzen processors. 
The third generation of AMD Ryzen processors saw a huge improvement in single-core performance, which enabled these processors to compete against the latest Intel i-series processors, and thanks to better power efficiency, a lot of people are preferring AMD Ryzen processors over Intel ones. AMD Ryzen 7 3800X is an octa-core processor, providing a total of 16 threads, thanks to the SMT technology. We can see a huge increase in the 3 lira cache of the processor, raised from 16 MB to 32 MB. The processor has a base clock of 3.9 GHz and has a max boost clock of 4.5 GHz. It is based on the 7NM process and supports PCIe 4.0 as well, which is the latest technology in PCI Express. The processor comes with AMD Wraith Prism RGB cooler, which is a pretty neat looking cooling solution.